Nikki, and this is my gorgeous family. Chris, Bo, Bear, and our salty sea dog, Ava. <laughs> we are sailing around the world on pickle. An old catamaran we bought and did up <laughs> after my major life-changing moment when I caught meningitis. Subscribe and enjoy the ride. We're going, shall we? I've won as well. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I think. Cabo de Palos. It's just, right at the bottom of Marminor. Yeah, we're just going round and then we'll be sailing alongside Marminor. We're actually sailing. How about it? six knots too? We didn't know whether we should be going round that big rock. No, there, was it there. rock? I'll show you. It's a rock. Let me just show you now. Can you see that rock? Hang on. Let me turn the camera and I'll show you. See, there's a rock out there which you can't see on my camera but it is there and then there's rocks just there and it's very little to read in the pilot guide about it and all the other boats well that one out there he's gone he's going right out but we read what did you read 200 meters off should be good i think it was this place i think it was this place anyway <laughs> 200 meters off somewhere. 200 meters off, we're, we're sure. So we're doing about six knots, sailing the good life, and we're risking it. We're gonna do it. We're throwing the little ribs. Yeah, we're throwing through there. We're gonna go around the corner, and then we'll have the wind on the beam, and then we might even go even faster than six knots. Yeah, Woo! Sailing we're away. sailing. Yeah, Woo! Yeah, that's good to sail. That's really good. This is proper sailing. This is when you feel happy. You're at your best. Everything feels great. Until we uh, hit rocks because we shouldn't be going through here. But no, that's not gonna happen really. This is amazing. Amazing. Woo. And this is the other side of the boat. There's a little marina tucked in there. They're popping up all over the place, aren't they? People want to earn money. Yeah, very, busy, very busy looking now. We're very, very, very close. Well, we're joking for 200 metres. Oh, I've looked at the plotter. Let's have a look. If we zoom in, go to the boat, zoom yeah, in. in That's 250 there. metres there. Ooh, it's close. It's going to be really close there. How do you see it's 250 That's metres? There, 250 metres. That's your 250 oh, metres. Yeah. So up there, we're going to be too close. It's going to be really close. Well, we'll be alright. We'll be alright. We'll see it watching down. We'll be alright, he says. Right. Well, there's a yacht following. 21 metres at the moment. Might get choppy around here. Oh, it's here, dropped, dropped a bit of speed here. Yeah, yeah the yacht's following behind us. He thinks we're... Speed was sticking up 6.5 then. Oh, was he? He thinks we know what we're doing. We don't know what we're doing. Don't follow us. <laughs> we don't know. We just don't know. Rocks are looking a bit close, yeah, aren't he's, they? He's giving it a bit of a wider berth behind us. Yeah, I blame him. But he's motoring. I can actually see the rocks from out the water there. Just there. Yeah, well, the are over there. Yeah. Let's go through them rocks, eh? It's so exciting! There's the lighthouse, Cabo de Palos. 
lighthouse for the mum and all. There's my gorgeous daughter sitting in my chair. Looks a bit choppy around there, you know. And Bear's got the amp because he doesn't want to eat behind my bread, miserable sod. It does look a bit more choppy. That's all right. We can do choppy. That's scary, that. <laughs> it just means it's sad. Oh, it's still scary. Yeah, that's good, that's a good bit. Yeah, that well, not rock. That's alright. Oh, 6.9 metres, I fucking shit my pants now. Seven. Oh, the engine's on because we're a bit shit in it. Where's he? He's out, isn't he? Out. 40 metres, we're through, I think. We just need to turn a little bit. Our engines on just in case we need them. That's a little bit scary. That was low, that was low, really, really shallow then. Six point something then, Bo! Six point something, Bo! Scary, scary! There's the marmalade, there we go, there's all the tar blocks I said about along the marmalade strip. They're on the outside of it then? Yeah, they're on that strip of sand. Behind that is the inland sea of the marmalade. Oh, look, he's coming, look, he's coming. He's If we get through, we can get through, don't <laughs> he? You can make it, buddy! He's doing exactly the same thing. Well, I don't blame him. He knows that he can get through if we did, doesn't he? He's like, yeah, let's see if they're running round or not. Yeah, isn't it? If we're running round, they're too pissed off, off So we really are going to be buggered if it's not. I don't know where we're going to go. Where are we going to go? If there's no one else anchored there, we're anchored there. We're probably going to get shouted at and fine. Right. I don't know. Yeah. But we'll probably sail off in the morning anyway. We do want to try and get to the Balearic. Time is sort of of the essence, as we only have 90 days. So probably a lot less than that now. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. Anyway. Okay. So there we are. A lovely sail once again. Sail still up. The winds were, were, were going to be constant throughout the night, we keep saying, but they're not, they're dying off, which is a bit of a shame. Is that a new bikini? It's a very pretty bikini. <laughs> These two have got fun out their bum. It gets night time, they get a bit tired, and they go stupid. Oh, stupid pants. Look, look at them. I practice, like playgrounds on my boat. Anyway, I'll nice. show you the anchorage. Yeah. Look at that beautiful sky, it's got that pink now. I'm 
I told you about this island by dark, Chris. Only because I put a bloody engine on. Chris, I Only because I put a bloody engine on. I told you this morning I was going to make it. Only because I put a bloody engine on. I didn't say that. I wouldn't put the engine on, though. And guys, look at our deflated tender. Yeah. To be fair, though. Look at the state of that. This is really easy. I can use that. Oh, yeah. I love when you hit something. Go and show them close up with that bloody tender. I can swim. Tell them. All right. So, basically, we were in the anchorage. So I, had to, I had to swim from shore to the boat about... And a half mile, three quarters of a mile. Me and Mum both had to. But it's too flat to come back. I know. I just to the boat. I know. I went with her. Don't worry, guys. So, this is Dinghy. Oars are mallard. The engine. Okay. But look. All bleached from the sun. Look, hot. All these bits where the ropes are have been ripped off. Um and yeah you can visualize how much it goes down so that's our lovely tender this is our beautiful boat that i love our boat yeah. Yeah. no i'm fine whatever you think you, you just tell me to drop it yeah guys you can see the bottom man you can see the bottom is it sun yeah yeah and the beautiful moon what are we down here You look very pretty, <laughs> Mummy. That's a pretty little boat there, look at it. Oh, wow. Oh. That's unusual. Anyway. I just had some amazing news. Have you? Yeah, I made this new friend on Instagram. I think it was like a YouTube channel and stuff. He's buying a big, big power cat. He really is a pilot, I think, guy. He really knows what he's doing. You know, he's like, um, got enough money to buy, you know, a nice boat. <laughs> like our old boat. But, um, yeah, I think we're meeting up with him at some point. I think Chris is going to go and look at our boat and stuff with him. Seems a really nice guy. Um, and I was telling him about this whole different tender we've got. And I had to swim from shore to the boat. And he's just like offered, you know, to like support us or sponsors or whatever. And um, get a tender. That's crazy. No. How nice is that? I mean, people are nice, but that's crazy nice, isn't it, Bo? Yeah, that's, that's well, out of this well, world. What a thing to do. Six metres. Really nice, so we really yeah. appreciate it. Yeah. So, hello. Anchor's down. Anchor's down. Try, so we've got weed first time. So I'm trying to hit a sandy patch. I don't think it's weed, in. I think it might be blocks. Oh, okay, blocks, yeah. It does say actually in the Navalee that there's rocks and sand here, so that's okay. We're down. We're holding really well. Daddy's going to jump in, check it because he's the man of the house. He's the man of the And we made it! We finally got down, didn't we, Daddy? Yeah, look. Same for it, same for it, same for it. Mum, you're always right. You're never not. Everything <laughs> you right, say is right. Wrong. <laughs> yeah. Look at that sunset. Yeah, and I'll do a panoramic view. What a beautiful evening. What a fabulous day sale. It's the best sale we've had for ages. I know. Best sale I've had for two years. <laughs> yeah, it probably is. I don't know. That's a good one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, Covid ruined all our sailing, didn't it? Melilla, didn't we? The moon. Good sailing, it? Your camera's a bit foggy, Mum. Hello, moon. Hello. Bye, bye, sunshine. Bye. bye. See you You'll see the sun go down. Remember, like, subscribe, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok if you want to see my funny side. And you can always become a patron if you like what we're doing and want to support our productions. <laughs>
That's a good idea. Come. Watch. Go then, Bertie died. Wow, I did a circle. Well done. I'm going to do a backside. Oh, both there, careful. Ow. That was close. In fact, it's like a barbecue for dinner, like burgers and new potatoes, salad. Are we, are we having a barbecue? Yeah, no, something like that. Something Yay! While we continue to have fun and explore these crystal clear, beautiful Mediterranean waters, I just want to say thanks for watching guys. Thanks for subscribing. Remember, leave us a thumbs up. That really helps. And if you like these productions, you can always become a patron and get all the extra footage and see what we're doing behind the scenes. The link is in the description below. Take care. See you next time.